start being more self-aware just noticing what are my most frequent thoughts what are my most frequent feelings Hi friends, this is Soul Coach Nikita. Welcome to my channel. Today we're talking about self-awareness. What is it and how to cultivate it? So self-awareness, what the name already says, is being aware of yourself. Observing yourself without judging yourself. What are your thoughts? What are your feelings throughout the day? Um, imagine as if you were a third person looking at yourself, like a, a bird's eyes view, looking at yourself, at your thoughts, at your feelings. And in today's society, we are used to just doing one thing after the other. We're like robots, waking up, so checking social media, getting ready, going to work, lunch, work, and then we might do a hobby or meet some friends for a drink or hit up social media again. And we're just doing one thing after the other. And we aren't really aware what we're doing. We're just like a machine going through one thing after the other. And being self-aware means knowing in every single moment what you're doing being aware okay i am sitting here right now my back is straight i'm looking in the camera right or you're watching this video how are you breathing right now while watching this video what are you feeling do you feel some tension in your neck or are you free um always 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 observing yourself but not judging that's the most important thing not judging yourself for feeling feeling sadness or happiness or whatever it is Notice throughout your day, when you wake up, when you check social media, when you're talking with certain friends, while you're eating, while you're uh, with your co-workers, how are you feeling? What thoughts, what feelings come up? If someone says something that annoys you, why is it annoying you? Or if someone says something that hurts you, where do you feel the hurt? Is it in your chest, in your heart area, in your stomach? How are you feeling? Where are you feeling it? And what are your thoughts that come by? Which thoughts create which feelings inside of you? Start opening up your lens, like the lens of your mind, opening up and just looking at it and, and letting, like watching, like watching trains. You can imagine that your thoughts are like trains. They come and go. And just watching them, not holding on to a train, just letting them drive by and just watching them. And if being self-aware is new to you, get a journal and write down the most frequent thoughts that you have during the day, the most frequent feelings. Just keep it always with you. And if you keep thinking, um, this person annoys me, or why did that situation happen in the past? If this thought always comes up, write it down. It's not bad, it's not good. Just write it down and observe yourself. And then you can see if there are uh, frequent patterns or if you keep judging yourself if you're like I'm not good enough and you keep repeating this thought again and again throughout your day you will see it in the journal and then you can see okay this is a pattern let me change that every time you do something well you do something good give yourself a compliment like yeah I did something so well and I'm so happy and I'm so proud of you give, keep giving yourself compliments and notice how your your joy just like you get you get even happier and you you start being more joyful and this will keep attracting more joy in your life more happiness in your life so my exercise for you is to start being more self-aware just noticing what are my most frequent thoughts what are my most frequent feelings and what happens before that thought that thought comes up what happens before that feeling comes up and write it down so this is my quick video on self-awareness comment down below what you want to see more or if you have any questions and like and subscribe and i can't wait to see you all next time